Hey, I have news. <laughs> I just found out. I just found out. So there is an achievement for giving the astrologer a gold book. Turns out it has nothing to do with selling him a gold book. It's something to do with a quest. And you can actually miss that achievement for that quest. So what I've decided that I'm going to do instead of, I mean, I, I, this, I believe is going to be one of those games that uh, unfortunately doesn't actually get 100%ed because I hate missable achievements. I mean, if it wasn't such a big deal, if I just had to play the game again, well, technically I do actually just have to play the game again to do it, but that doesn't seem like fun. I don't want to play the whole game again just to give the just to give the astrologer a gold book. That's just bleh, that, that's yuck. That's yuck. So instead of doing that, I'm just going to finish out the rest of the main game. And um, I mean, I might come back to this over time. Might. Just to finish it out. We'll see. Um, let's go ahead and uh, see what's going on here. Whoopsies. There we go. I heard you were organized a rat race. That's great. Sure did. Maybe it'll inspire the cultists to drown more inquisitors. Hmm. Hi, priestess. Um, please don't be upset, but the village is destroyed. Half of us were taken prisoner. The rest were killed. We already know, my friend. Go now. Rest and feed your family. What? Go grab your swords and fight. We must take revenge, Bella. My dear Clotha, what's the point of that? Look. Dad's been badly wounded. Someone help him. Roderick, ha, huh? what a pleasant surprise. But before I tear out your eyes and tongue, tell me, why did you do it? Because of Chain, I love her, but the ancient god forbids. What? This is all about love? Amazing, unbelievable, ha ha ha. Nevertheless, it's all in vain, Herodric. Chain was captured and is about to be executed. Take care of my dad. Diggis, I ordered you to tuck away some golden apples from the Tree of Wisdom. I managed to hide three, and I had to eat the other two. Clotho, he's bleeding to death. Mm, yes, Bella, it would be most unfortunate if Diggis, who's grown so wise, suddenly died. Ha, huh, you must invent a ritual for us, Apple Eater. A ritual that will kill all our enemies at once. Write the Necronomicon, then we will heal you. An interesting twist. By the way, you never finished your story. What story? Ah, about the portal. Well, we looked for the keys and their bearers for five years. Did you find them? I think so, but then I don't remember. Here, have some ancient shackles. Hmm, it'll be interesting to see who these shackles belong to. To one of the numberless victims of the new fate? I take it you killed the guards on the upper floors, Roderick. Impressive. Guys, go get us some beer for the four of us. You'll have to cut off my legs, Kreswold, or I will march on. You don't understand. You think Jove and Lucius don't know who saved Diggis? If you rescue Chain, they'll declare you a traitor and a heretic. Brother, let's sit together, have a beer, and talk it over, just like old times. It will never be like old times, Kreswold. Hmm. 
and brother, my brother would have helped me chain rescue chain. There's a lot of bodies up there. Chain. Oh, hi, birdie. Honey, did you... What did they do to you? No, they did. Oh, Hori. Is that you? It's over, my love. You're free. Here, take my hand. Remember my promise? We're together at last. We can be happy. Hori, we... Happy? Happy? Yeah, yeah, I know. Everything went to hell, and it's all my fault, but... In the end, our love is what's really important. Hori, dear, look around. Love? Uh, the whole world is ruined. Tell me, is it right for such love to exist? Forgive me, my dear, but I, I can't. I mean, it kind of seems like Herodric caused this whole problem. Sad, but it makes sense. Did you remember anything new? Oh yes, the keeper asked the portal to return him home. And then, boom. Holy sard, the keeper is dead. The others, they're all dead. Maybe the keeper didn't formulate his wish correctly, or maybe it was something else. After all, the man with the red eye found me and took me away. That's all I remember. Amazing. Okay, let's get to the next artifact. An ancient pickaxe, and it belongs to Gopal. I also see here that we need the ancient keys to the prison cell, and... They are in Adam's home. Is that right? Cool. You're a quick study. Let me look. Damn. The ink ram. The machine says which hill. Try to dig around there. Dig something up on which hill. Okie dokes. Ask Kukul for a pickaxe. Adam? Okay, he's probably gone at the moment. No, oh, never mind. He's here. Adam. Ancient keys. It won't be easy to convince Adam to let me inside his home. Adam, I've been waiting a long time for the chance to see your collection of antiques. You really want to see them? Why? You plan to criticize me or you're gonna break something? Nope, I just wanted to enjoy the art. Hmm, you don't look like an art connoisseur to me. Prove it. Bring me three high-quality vases. Three high-quality vases. Three of those. You got it. I'll see what I can do. Three of those. I'm capable of making those, right? Right? Uh... Ah, uh, that's here, okay. Alright, let's go see Kukul. Actually, wait, hold on. Hold on a minute, hold on, hold on, we'll get there. We'll get there. Let's take this opportunity to wander around. It, it's possible that I may end up coming back at some point to finish out the rest of the game. The rest of the achievements, but it is likely, it is very likely that I'm not going to 100% this game quite yet. Buy an ancient pickaxe. 
What do you need? You're spoiling my business. Looks like I'm your only customer at the moment. Then buy something and get out. I need an ancient pickaxe. Really? That's a rare pickaxe. I heard it once belonged to the first king. You really want it? Then help me with my hump. The doctors are useless. Find a witch who can help. I want to look like everyone else. Clotho. Sure. I'm wandering around here because there is possible chance that I could find one of those lovely, lovely golems. Rock golems, whatever you want to call them. It's possible, it could be around here. A clay pot of tar. I see. Did I just find a shovel? Here? Like, that's a weird place to find a shovel. should bring some fertilizer here. Am I actually going to do this? Is this really something I'm going to do? No, I'm just going to do this. And then, if I need more later, then I'll get more later. Tons and tons and tons of gold star grapes is the plan. Why, you ask? Well, because... Hoping that making just a ton of berry plant or uh, a ton of uh, pies. Oops, did I not? All right, fine. I 
can't be perfect every time. Anyways, I I hope to make a, a ton, just a ton of um, berry pies, just gold star berry pies. I think, I think that will allow me to I do think that will allow me to... Possibly pass the... Thing? A porcelain pitcher. Three of these, they require white powder. Okay, sure, I can go get that. Yeah, I, I, I had a train of thought there that I sort of lost. That's okay, though. Do I want to turn this all into red wine? Uh, I mean, it, it wouldn't hurt to just make a bunch of red wine, yeah. Sure. May as well. Body. Uh, that should be like body number two that's just sitting on the ground now. Should be. What do you have? A dark brain, okay. plan. I have an idea. At some point, I am going to make... I am going to make one of those evil bodies, and it's going to be great. I don't actually know if it'll have any purpose or any use whatsoever. I just think it'll be fun. Honestly. Salt, that's not white powder. It's kind of like white powder, but not. Evil could be an evil bot part. Nope. <laughs> nope. If only. If only. Alright, well, we'll take the fat. Take the skin. Actually, a pretty good part here too. There's a part of me that wonders if I could, because I mean, there's there's room for more body parts. So one of these, nope, one of these bodies that I get at some point, I'm gonna want to try and. I'm going to try and max out and see what happens. Cause it sounds fun. OK. 
Okay, so there's a dark brain. And there's just a three and three brain, which is pretty sweet. Toss some fat in there. be happy with how much skin I have until I have just all universal bags. Oops, silly me. You can stay here. Okay, what are you doing right now? Nothing. You can do stuff, but I don't need you to do stuff. I need white powder, which is going to be here. I do believe it said six of them, two for each. Porcelain pitchers, so we're going to go ahead and make those. Awesome. Roof tiles. Where do I make roof tiles? every once in a while. Where do I make roof tiles? Is that what these are? This is carved wood. This lets me create carved wood, which I may as well get by now. I feel like I, I have enough supplies to get this stuff now. That seems like a fine idea. So I now know how to make carved wood, which is cool. I mean, I would guess that the... I would guess that would make the roof tiles here? It doesn't seem like it. I do make the curtains here. That's cool. One, two, three, four. No, no. Hmm. So not here.
No. Hmm. Roof tiles. Ah. Roof tiles. How many roof tiles do I need? How many roof tiles do I need? 24 roof tiles. I need 24 bowls. go let's go check the body please be a good one you have no idea how much I want you to be a good body please pretty please Ugh. Still nope. Fine. Take the skin. This is a pretty good looking part right here. start taking some of the parts that I that I like more some of the parts that look better I'm gonna start saving them so that I can possibly use them later to make cooler combinations of things. I almost have enough to make another bag. See you, Jerry. So I need to go talk to Clotho about Kukol. It's not late enough in the day yet. Not officially Sunday yet. I see.
cloth was not out here yet either. Sigh. Well, she's got to come out eventually, right? I guess I'll go pick some mushrooms while I'm waiting. Okay, Clotho, you must be out by now, right? And if you're not, then you're evil. Yeah, there you are, okay. Ask her to help Kukul. Hey, can you help Kukul? How are you, my sweet? What can old lady do for you? Clotho, can you rid a man of a hump? Oh, I'm so sorry, my sweet. And you're so young. Here, let Clotho take a look. No, no, it's not me. Not you. Thank the ancient god. Such a beautiful keeper with a hump. Yuck. Believe me, it's not me. My mm, friend Kukul wants to look like everyone else. He... Oh, I see. Take this spell scroll. You'll also need a dark organ, and Kukul definitely has a couple. All right. Cool. Thanks. I'll buy that. And I'll buy those too. Silver elixir. Scroll with a spell. Cool. We'll take these over to the dead horse. And from here, I'll go see Adam. Hey, here's your vases. I don't look at these vases, they're masterpieces. Hmm, vases? Those aren't vases, they're crooked glass pots. You think I'm a fool and a drunkard? You can never slip me this garbage, never. Okay, don't get upset, what kind of vases do you want? Beautiful, rare, and expensive. Watch your vases, I'm only buying them so I can break them. Take five silver. Alright, sure, five silver is good money, I agree. I can always talk to Merchant about the vases I need. Alright then. Not quite done with that one. Uh, I need to go do my sermon, now that it's like, officially daytime. And then, I can go talk to Tras and give him the stuff that he wanted, needed, or whatever. Alright, our church is great. Let's earn a whole bunch of faith. Nice! Excellent. 
Okay, now back to the dead horse so that I can get stuck on things and then go find Tress. It was not you? I could have sworn it was you. Oh, to the woodcutter, okay. I was close. But you are not the woodcutter. You are the woodcutter. There we go. Here's your roof tiles, and here's your curtains. I brought everything you asked for, I hope. You still haven't eaten that apple? No, like Father always said, never eat anything that's more profitable to sell. And he got extremely rich, you know, though he died of exhaustion. After that, I gave away all my wealth to the poor and moved here. Cool. Well, I guess we just wait for Kukul now. On Trader Day, I can see the merchant. already. Gee, I didn't think you would be here so fast. All right. Here. Oh, it took you so long. Even with my limp, I could have done it faster. If you want to get rid of your hump, please keep quiet and listen. I have magic scroll, but we also need a dark organ. A dark organ? That's easy. Take your pick. A heart, brain, or intestine. Testing. Wait for me here tomorrow. Okay. Oh, I should have said a heart, huh? Because <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna. Do you think I'm gonna get to keep it? Hmm. I guess I better keep keep getting more bodies. Until I have that dark heart, I'm just sort of stuck. I better go check on... Oh, these aren't done yet, okay.
There we go. Maybe I should just keep asking for more bodies. Because why not, right? Okay, plant scraps need to go here. Nope, here. Leave that in there too. Oh wait, that's not all of it. There we go. I need to do to finish up with the Inquisitor. I need to wait. And I need to wait. Okay. Let me do some meditating then. Pass some time. Alright, to the refugee camp. To Doro. To Doro, good sir. To Doro. What do you mean when my bargain is complete? I th isn't my bar part of the bargain complete? <laughs> Honey pudding? Ooh. Look at that, you're actually gaining supplies here. Hmm. That's... that's something, isn't it? Cream of mushroom soup, honey pudding... I would love some cabbage. I happen to need some. Oops. Show me your inventory here. Have this, and this, and this. And these. Why not? Sure. Lasagna? Oh my goodness. I guess I'll wait.
I guess I'll wait for a while. I'm just I'm waiting to find a dark heart. And I'm waiting for Kokul. No dark heart. So sad. billets do I like I always need more Energy just coming back. Amazing. pick berries but I just want to wait for the trader to get there so I'm gonna do that whoops I didn't mean to still have these billets with me there we go there. I need some vases. My friend, do you have any expensive vases? Oh, unfortunately, you're a bit too late. I just sold them to, to that weirdo beekeeper. I'm sure you've seen him around. Right. Beekeeper. He's not here yet. There he is. Good timing. About the vases. Ah, oh, I know you've been talking to Adam. He sent you to kill me and my bees. Believe it or not, I just need the vases you bought. You want to give them to Adam? I do. Ah, uh -huh. that's why I bought them. I knew Adam wanted them. I figured out that Adam is Hornet Man and I foiled my enemy's plans. He's crazy, but I need those vases. You're right. He's Hornet Man and this is your chance to defeat him. What, what do you mean? Put poisoned honey into the vases. Adam will taste it and die. Excellent plan. I'll get my revenge at last, but alas, my hypertoxic bee poison were stolen by my other foe, Dig. Time to go talk to Dig. I mean, this just seems like it's becoming a recipe for disaster, if you ask me. Oops, stuck. Welcome, welcome, guests. Taste this divine cake I made. It looks delicious. What's it made of? Hypertoxic bee poison. Deadly sweet. The perfect way to keep people as your guests forever. Wow, uh, it's quite tempting, but take a bite or I'll bite you. This is my holiday. I'm the host. I need a new plan right now. If it's your holiday, then let's play some games before we eat the cake. Some games? How nice. I'll be the Sphinx, and you'll be the fool. Listen to my riddle. It grows in spring, it falls in fall. Apples? Oh. 
cakes? Yes, cakes with bee poison. Hooray, you won the whole cake. I see. Cool, I'll share some of it with Beekeeper and come back and play some more. Okay, but be careful with that guy. I think he's crazy. Alright, thanks. Let me go talk to the beekeeper. Here you go. Listen closely. Take all the poison from that cake, mix it with honey, and put it in the vase. Wait a minute. Oh my sweet... Oh my revenge will be sweet, horned man. Ready. Take the vases and hurry to Adam. Alright. Vases of poison. Here's your vases. There's honey inside, don't ask why. But I advise you to throw it away, it doesn't look fresh. Yuck, honey reminds me of that wonderful woman, the pastry chef, who rejected me. Just like all the others. In any case, the vases are quite welcome. Welcome to my home. Wonderful. Some ancient keys. Very cool. And I see you have some other stuff here too, but I'll be nice, I won't take it all. Thanks though. Well, now I'm going to head home. And I'm going to meditate, either until nighttime or until the next body arrives, whichever comes first. Well, there we go. Still no dark heart. Oh my goodness. That's... That's just wild. Okay. Dang it. <laughs> Every time. Alright, Mountain Fort. Cool call. About the Dark Organ. <laughs> Take this one. A few days ago, we caught down a crowd of walking dead near the pass. What are you waiting for? Read the spell. You sure maybe we're stuck with sage precautions? Read it or I'll kill you. Boom, boom, bum, bum. I want to look like everyone. Boom, boom, bum, bum. I want to look like everyone. Boom, boom, bum, bum, want to look like everyone. Hmm, something went wrong. Your hump is still there, like usual. Ah, but look, now you have a hump. Ha, ah, you... <laughs> and look over there, a pair of hunchback squirrels. Really? No, I don't see anything like that. Oh, I know, the spell makes you see everyone like you with humps. It's an illusion? Man, I thought now everyone had humps. That would have been cool. So, I see you failed. You can't forget about that pickaxe. Hmm. Listen, Kugel, how about free drinks in my town? Well, Roderick doesn't even let me into his inn. Because I tend to scare off his customers. I'm much more tolerant towards hunchbacks. That's good, but I'm not tolerant of bad taverns. But you put out some decent tables and chairs and you'll get the pickaxe. Right. Alright, well, I did end up getting some dark intestines. I 
wish I had thought about that beforehand. I would have absolutely asked for the heart instead. Like a smart person. Unfortunately, smarter me was not there at this time. Taverns. Or tavern tables. I see. I'm going to need some cloth. Eight cloth to be exact. Okay, well... Well, I, I think that's gonna do it for... That, that, that's gonna do it for today. Now, I do believe that's gonna do it for today. And I say that because... Cool. <laughs> and I say that because, um, well, I mean, it's been almost an hour. It's, I, I know it's a couple minutes short at the moment, I know, but I am the last part went a little bit long, so we've done quite good, quite good. The remaining achievements at this point are basically finishing the storyline, finishing the, the all this quest tavern stuff and um, catching fish and making things. So that being the case, I, I may actually put this now on the back burner because we're pretty much done with it. We are pretty much done with this game. There might be some more to it, but I think we're pretty much done with this game. So I'm going to kind of put this one on the back burner a little bit and um, try starting up a, a few new things, I believe is what I'm going to do. But for now, that's all I got for you. That's all I got for you. It's been fantastic. I'm going to... Go ahead and exit up to the main menu so we get that nice main menu music to, to finish up with. Thank you. Thank you for joining me for any length of time during any of these parts. You're welcome to come join me here live in my nest anytime you wish. Or if you just want to watch on YouTube, that's totally cool too. That's exactly why I upload them there. So... Thank you for joining me, all you beautiful birdies. I'm Stormcrow. This has been Graveyard Keeper. Pretty fun, actually. Pretty fun. We're, we're pretty much done with it. Mostly done. Just finishing up some achievements. So we'll come back to it every now and then to see what we can do. But for now, that's all I got for you. I need to take a rest. And then I don't know what we're doing this weekend yet. I don't know what we're doing. We're not, uh, we're not gonna go through that portal yet, because we're just not quite done with it. I know, wild. Uh, but we'll get there. We will get there. For now then, thank you for joining me. Bye everyone, I'll see you next time. I'm Stormcrow, and this is Stormcrow 1. Bye for now.